and it's good afternoon from Mark Pugach at Aintree. It's one of the great days in the British sporting calendar, Grand National Day. We'll have all the build-up to the great race throughout the afternoon, and in our three o'clock game, it's free-falling Stoke playing Aston Villa. Welcome, everyone, to the Britannia Stadium. We've got a few stories here this year, haven't we? Everyone talking about Seabass and about Katie Wolves. So our three o'clock commentary, just over 15 minutes away, Stoke against Aston Villa, and as John Murray told us earlier, John Villa have gone for a very bold line-up this afternoon. Yes, they have quite a call from Paul Lambert, the Villa manager for this one, bringing young forward Jordan Bowery into the team. The paddock has cleared as if the bell has sent them all away. They're edging towards the tape now for the 2013 Grand National. Will we get a first-time start here? The crowd aware of it. Edging forward. Right. Come on, starters happy. We've got a first-timer in the Grand National. They're away safely. T for three is in second place. And these are clear, but it is all rollers on core. Virtually unmentioned beforehand. Coming home to deafening silence. Ryan Mania, his first ever Grand National ride. And he's got to won it. Oh, my Harvey, God. Harvey Smith. Harvey Smith and Sue Smith. Harvey Smith. Let's grab Harvey. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe you're close to tears. Why not? <laughs> You don't win a big and every day, do you? How good is that? Superb. Absolutely superb. Left foot and true. Pass goes out into the net. And it's Stoke 1, Aston Villa 1. He must score. He does score. Benteke wins the game for Aston Villa. Boos from the home supporters here at the Britannia Stadium. But a huge, huge victory for Paul Lambert's team. It's five o'clock on this Saturday afternoon at Aintree. And this is Sports Report. It's the man of the moment, Ryan Mania. His first ever Grand National ride has produced a win in the most famous steeplechase in the world. Congratulations, Thank you Ryan. very much. Thank you.